before I start this video, I just want to acknowledge the beauty of nature and how it never fails to put your mind at ease no matter what mood you're in. But anyways, what's going on guys? Rashad here with another video. And today I'm going to talk about my experience with addiction and how I personally overcame it. So uh, I'm going to keep this one brief. Um, I haven't really dove uh, too much into the psyche of addiction and, and what it really technically does to the mind. But uh, for me, uh, I was addicted to, to marijuana and to uh to porn and those were at least for me personally those were very those were two very harmful vices that i was allowing to accumulate my time and as as time went on it just got worse and i just kept the quantity increased and of course the quality decreased and i had to notice that but one thing that dawned on me was that in denial you know, all these years, me saying, oh, no, this is an addicting is just something I genuinely enjoy. I know, you know, everyone's had a friend that was addicted to, you know, some type of substance and kind of used their genuine liking for it as an excuse to continue doing this, making the same mistakes, making the same habits. And I had to truly accept it. You know, I had to actually call it for what it was. I had to see the situation face value. And I was like, all right, I'm an addict. I'm a fiend. I can't go without this right now. And when I had that, when I was telling myself that for a brief moment, it got worse because I started, it's like I kind of manifested that and became that. I became that addict and I just kept doing it, kept doing it, kept doing it. But the more I was acceptance to it, the more at peace I felt when it was time to let it go. And it was a natural feeling of just like, okay, I acknowledge that this is something I'm addicted to, whether I'm not doing it or whether I'm not. And I had to come with peace at him. Like, okay, one day I'm going to have to put this down. I'm going to have to stop. I'm going to have to limit the usage. And it was easy and it's been easy to just accept and to uh, and to embrace because it's real but it's a part of you and yeah i mean i like marijuana i wish i can like one right now whatever but i'm not and that's the thing and i don't feel i don't feel bad about it i i accept that i accept the love i have for the vice so um this isn't like a video telling you know um people to stop you know, smoking weed or masturbating or anything that's accumulating the time, but it really just is do it because you want to and not because you have to. That's when it becomes a problem. Sorry, I'm sweating. It's hot out here, but it's it's peaceful. So I'll, I'll, I'll take the five minutes of hard sweat. But yeah, that's it, guys. So currently right now I've been sober for three days and um, I know that's not a... Uh, a big deal but i like to celebrate the small wins in life you know that's how we keep moving that's what keeps us sane so uh i want to keep giving these videos out i want to keep um shedding light on my human experience and hopefully i can touch some people out there so that's it guys thank you for listening thank you for taking the time to listen and hopefully understand and maybe i could uh maybe i could touch some people so um Leave a comment below, like the video, uh, let me know if there's any topics or anything specific you want me to shed light on. I will feel more than happy to do so. So thank you guys. Peace out.